Hi everybody, I'm Tim Doty from Fox 17 and I want to thank all of you for being here tonight. Every year thousands of animals come through these doors at the Humane Society of West Michigan. Tonight we'll introduce you to one of them and tell you how a family was affected by a dog named Miracle. Meet Andy, a 28-year-old single dad from West Michigan. Having just gone through a separation, Andy found himself in a new home and all alone. That's when he decided he needed a dog. I came to the Humane Society because I like the way that they try to match people up with pets, um, companion animals, or just a regular family pet. After meeting a couple of other dogs, Andy met Miracle, a pit bull who came to West Michigan from Saginaw. Volunteers pulled her out because at the time there was a breed ban, and that means that um, that area did not allow pit bulls. So if we didn't pull her out, there was a good chance that she didn't make it out, make it out alive uh, from that facility. As a lot of people can see on her face, um, she does have some scarring on her face with her lip and then on the back of her legs too. So she may have been one of the beat up dogs or somebody may have tried to train her to fight. It's really difficult to watch a dog <laughs> Oh, that almost lost that trust in people and she wasn't born with it. It's something that people taught and it's really hard for people who work in a shelter environment to see. Um, she was never really given a fair chance um, at life and over time, she still trusted some people. And that, to me, is the true quality of dogs and pit bulls. And that's something that I think we all should remember. In the months that Miracle was here in West Michigan, she became part of the Bark program, which matches pets with troubled teens. We help juvenile detention residents uh, by building compassion. They, they learn to be empathetic towards other individuals, including dogs. And our shelter dogs, like Miracle, really learn great skills so that they can go to a new home and be part of the family. Despite a somewhat troubled past, Andy was convinced that Miracle was the dog for him. There's no bad dog. There's bad owners. And that has never been truer than with this little girl right here. Uh, the breed is so sensationalized for some of the incidents that could happen with any breed, but because there are so many of them that I think people's way of dealing with it is to get rid of what we're afraid of. While well, Andy was sure, there was still one very important test to come. A week later, I brought my daughter in and my daughter fell in love with her right away. We brought her home that day. An early challenge for the family came when Andy and his daughter, who suffers from cerebral palsy and is in a wheelchair, decided to take Miracle for a walk through the neighborhood. It was weird, as soon as my daughter grabbed this part of the leash while I still had the back of it, she stopped pulling and literally walked right next to my daughter's wheelchair. And it was a miracle. As soon as I saw that happen, I knew that she was gonna be a part of our life forever. I, I knew that there was, that she was the perfect match for our family. Stories like Miracle are very special to us here at Humane Society of West Michigan. We hope that you'll open up your hearts so that we can continue taking care of all of our animals and help them find their forever homes. Would I adopt a dog from the West Michigan Humane Society again in a heartbeat.